In this video, we'll demonstrate how to use Stack Height in Kali Linux to do steganography. We'll use Stack Height tool to embed a secret file within an image. Um, we'll do a few steps. In the first step, we'll install the Stack Height. So let's open the terminal and install Stack Height. This will take a few minutes to install, which is straightforward. So most there is no setting up stack height. So it's done. Stack height is installed. Now we will create a folder in the home directory where we will um, copy, download an image from the internet and put our image inside that folder. Um, so we plan to do it in the home directory. So we'll Let's check that we are in the home directory. This command will create a new directory named stack height under home directory. So as you can see, stack height directory is created. Now let's get an image from the internet. So in this image, we will basically embed our text file. Save the image in the stack height folder. And we are going to name the image as picture. So let's come back to the terminal again and check it out whether this folder got the image or not. So we are going to shoot the command ls. Yes, so the picture is downloaded. Next, we will write a text file and where we will have a text. The line is, this is steganography text using stack height. So let's create the text file. We are using leafpad to open a new uh, file, text file. Once we have the image and also the secret.txt, we'll embed the secret.txt within this image. So we'll use the command stack hide embed and then hyphen cf to flex, and then the target picture and the text file. It will ask for a passphrase and we'll provide the passphrase. So it seems like the, it did not find the target image because it is not JPEG, it is, it is JPEG. So giving the passphrase again, and it has embedded. Now we will transfer this embedded picture, picture.jpeg, to the destination 
for receiver and receiver will decode it or extract the text from this um, picture if he knows the passphrase so let's um, for the experimental purpose we will do the whole thing in the same station local machine so copying this picture from this folder to the home directory so as you can see the image is copied here and we don't have the text file here now we'll use stack hide extract command to extract the text that is embedded within this image and it will ask for the passphrase so the receiver has to know the password that is used to embed the text again the same issue it is jpeg And you can see the secret.txt is here. If we open it with leafpad, we can see we get our text back as well. Now, we can also look at the before extracting, if someone wants to um, know some of the information about that um, embedded picture that he received from the sender, um, then the user can use Stag height info. So stag height info and the um, name of the picture. So it only gives some basic information. To know more about the embedded information, it needs the pass passphrase. That means the receiver needs to know also passphrase to know the information about the embedded file. So you can see embedded file is secret.txt and also the size is given.